Tottenham have made inquiries about World Cup and Champions League winning captain Jerome Boateng and Southampton's Yannick Vestergaard. Before we get into those stories and one on Carlos Vinicius, if you are new to the channel and you want more transfer updates like these, plus the Tottenham Fan Voice podcast and Tottenham Watch Alongs, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and hit a like on this video if you are happy with this news. Now this is coming from Sky Sports who said that Tottenham will prioritise signing a centre-back in the upcoming summer window with Yannick Vestergaard and Jerome Boateng both subject of inquiries from the club. Jerome Boateng is 32 years of age and he, well, he perfectly fits into that, uh, that title of end the contract FC that Spurs have gotten with his contract running out at Bayern Munich at the end of this season. He's played 25 games this season and has won with a lot of experience really at the top level. A fantastic, fantastic trophy cabinet uh, will be brought with him and look... He's one that I think a lot of Spurs fans would be disappointed about if he is our main target because of his age and because of the, the lack of longevity in his career. But a very experienced player, a very talented player who has looked definitely faded away from what he used to be but still could offer a lot to Spurs. Now another player that we have made inquiries for is Yannick Vestergaard. The Southampton centre-back has just over a year left on his contract and has played 25 times in the league this season, bagging three goals as well. He's an aerial threat, very good at defending set pieces and crosses into the box, which... Let's be honest, it's something that Spurs could really, really do with. He stands at, I think, six foot six, very tall, a really powerful player. And in the last four or five months, as Southampton's form has has fallen away, I think Vestergaard has been one of the shining lights who's continued to play well and perhaps has been uh, has made that Southampton results look a little bit better with the, the defending he has offered them. Another story coming from Sky Sports News is that Spurs will also prioritise signing a striker in the upcoming summer window as they expect Carlos Vinicius to return to Benfica at the end of this season. Spurs, not just for Sky Sports News, but among a number of sources, are not expected to trigger the £35 million buyout clause in Carlos Vinicius' loan deal. Let me know in the comments below uh, your feelings on these stories. If you think those are the right centre-backs to be going for, if there are any other targets you think Spurs uh, should identify and potentially sign in the summer window. Like I said, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that like button if you've enjoyed this video. And as always, thanks for watching.